Hey guys and welcome back to Better Than Wolves. This is the third attempt I'm doing now to make an episode. We should be on episode 5 of all the progress I've made but we're on episode 3. Now there are things I want to show you that I've already showed you twice and I've got to do it now again for the third time. So I might forget some things and I'm deeply sorry if I do. Um, bow meal that's one thing i can't show you until night falls but as you can see here i've got three sails now i've taught you guys already how to make the sails even though it doesn't look that way but i have trust me so i'm going to do it again <coughs> and also probably quickly because i can't be asked to explain it anymore so let's grab these i can quickly do it that way as well oh wow that was quick that was spontaneous awesome now as you can see here the plants are growing wow okay Guys, chill, chill out. Got another seed here, which is great. That means we can probably make another sale, which would be awesome. Where are these hemp seeds? These marijuana seeds. I'd love to have them with me. All right, there we go. Okay, now, night's not fall. Oh, night is falling, isn't it? Is night falling, or is it becoming day? don't know got to be quick anyway so as you can see here the plants will give you hemp what you do is you put hemp in this thingamajiggle here and we gotta crank and crank this all down it will take a while it will also drain your health sometimes it does sometimes it doesn't it's very random and we don't i don't really get the logic of it fully yet. i think it's just a little miniature bug sometimes it does sometimes it doesn't but its main purpose is purpose is to drain your hunger night is falling upon us so i have to make a sword in a minute and kill some skeletons so i can show you the bow meal finally after five times now i think okay there's only four more left okay come on come on come on come on oh bloody hell see now the health is draining because i clicked on it again sometimes it does sometimes it does. So i'm going to start click it again might stop doing it this time. Nope, still draining. Click it again. Nope, it's going to keep on going. Which is good because it's also another thing I want to show you after I've also showed you twice already. It's done yet? No, there's one more. Come on. There we go, it's done. So, then you put the hemp in that and it will give you hemp fibers. Now, there are two things you can make from hemp fibers. You can, if you put six next to each other, you can make rope, but that's not what we're going to do. And if you put, fill the whole crafting table with it, you will get fabric. Now, so we're going to get one fabric here. See how much I can get out of this. Uh, I can get two out of that and that'll be 18. No, no, I'm just too short for a third one. So, anyway, now I've got three pieces of fabric. Now, to make a sail, I'm going to need six pieces of fabric like this. Uh, no, like this. You fill the top layers with fabric. So six pieces of fabric. And then put three with a bump and you'll get a sail. And you need four sails to make a windmill. So let's just put it down in this way of how many you need. You need nine hemp fibers for one fabric. You need six fabric for one sail. And you need four sails to make a windmill so you're gonna chomp your ass through so many hemp fibers it's unbelievable now the night has fallen so no hemp is gonna grow nothing is gonna grow because once the night falls or it starts raining nothing will grow that's a fact so we're all doomed nothing's gonna grow in this time and I need three more pieces of fabric before I can make the last sail now I'm gonna try and kill those skeletons over there even though I don't have food so it's kind of too dangerous don't blow up my house we spent two episodes building that little thing and you blow it. Oh, you didn't blow it up. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Uh, I'm one iron too short to make an iron sword. Otherwise, I would have done that. Would have been a lot better if I did. Just quickly get all of this. Seeing as it's in my way anyway. Cover it all up like nothing happened. Right, nothing there, nothing there. Okay, awesome. Let's get the dirt. I'm going to sneeze in a minute, so I'm preparing. I'm preparing. I'm just letting you guys know already. To prepare yourselves. Um, oh, wow, well, I've got enough dirt to uh, create a whole island. I need to take down those skeletons, but my hunger is very low. 
That's also one thing. Have I got anything to... Oh, wait, I can do that with the bones, of course. That's one thing. Oh, no, they've gone. Bummer. They poofed out of existence. Are there any down there? No, that's my wolf. Uh, I'm not going to take them down. I'm going to take down that sheep over there because I need him for food. Because you can see my hunger is extremely low. Oh dear. Oh, I can't jump over there. Should I take you guys with me? Use you guys for something once in my life. I can use you. I need some mutton chops. Because I'm hungry. Attack! Go wolfies! Awesome. Saw some iron over there as well, which I could really use. So I'm going to get that as well. Oh, I'm killing him with a feather. Doggies, go! Awesome. Good guys. Good lads. Um, get the iron. Oh, oh, don't drown. Don't drown. So far so good. I'm constantly checking to see if it is still actually recording or that the audio is still working and it is which is brilliant. Um, there was another sheep somewhere. Oh no wait, I took him down. Ah, oh, there were two skeletons right over here. Awesome. I want to only lure one, preferably, but it looks like I've lured both of them. Alright, you take that one down. I'll take this one. Guys, you are brilliant. Oh, there's another one. Guys, get him. What are you guys doing? What are you taking out? I oh, took out another one. Good guys. Good boys. There's more sheep over here. Now, I've got to be careful now. Down on half a heart. It's dangerous. Okay, quickly go to my base. Cook up this meat. That'd be awesome. Oh, guys. Attack him. Don't push him my way. <laughs> oh, these guys. They crap me up. Right. Throw that in there. Oh, that's all I've got. Is that it? Four's not enough. They give you, what, two and a half? So it will be enough. But I could use a lot. Less than that. Poor little fella. Poor little fella. Need another one. Come on. Come in. There we go. <coughs> I warned you guys, didn't I? Sorry, headphone users. I'm so sorry. Right, now it's time to start healing. So, I am going to put... Oh, wait, darn it. Okay, well, let me just tell you guys. If your hunger bar is three bones or less, you will not be able to use the meal. You'll get a message saying uh, you're too weak or you're not strong enough to use the meal at this stage because you are hungry. So what we're going to do, like I did last episode, we are going to put the bones in the meal, grind meal, meal grind, meal wall, meal grinder. Can't remember now. I'm going to quickly do that now so we don't waste our time. And instead of instantly growing the plants, you can see these little uh, grey spots here. That See, you put them here. And the in the new Minecraft, in the snapshot uh, 13w04a, bone meal also does not instantly grow things anymore. But it uh, grows it step by step because there are steps in the growth between wheat. And it will grow it at one stage or one step, whatever you want to call it. This doesn't even do that. It just speeds up the growing process. It will not... Oh, it will not go to the next level or instantly grow. It's just going to speed up the progress. Which is not that bad, but it you know it brings more realism. It just helps it grow faster. It does not bring any stages, nothing like that. So I'm going to do that with all of these. So hopefully we can uh, make a meal by tomorrow. And just get a nice good ending to this episode. I don't know how long we're running. Might have to make it a little... Oh, no, we were only nine minutes in. Plenty of time. Sun's coming up. Plenty of time, guys. Uh, put these all here. This one. All the, the ones that are about to sprout. 
the other ones I'm going to cover. Not that these these will have to grow up first. Because once uh, the plant has grown one stage, that seed will go away. It will, it will only help at one stage. And that's all it will help. So don't go spreading your bone meal around the whole farm. Just keep using it on the ones that are already pre-grown and you just wait for them to sprout. Use it on them. You'll gain a wheat a lot faster that way. Wheat? Hemp. Am I doing this for fun? Oh, I'm doing it for fun. Oh wow, that wasn't a lot of bear meal. So I've got three of them. Oh, I need to cook up my iron as well. Cook them up. Come on, grow! I need at least another... Oh, I need, I need another 20. It's not bad. No? Not even that. Yeah, I need another 20. Okay, guys, sit down. You're making me nervous. You're making me nervous. Siberian's a lot more... Better trained than you guys. Let's have a look at this bow. Rotten arrows. You don't get... You don't get normal arrows anymore. You get rotten arrows. Which you can still use, but they do less damage than normal arrows. Now, okay, so in the meantime, whilst they are trying to sprout, let's show you something. What people said to me, um, in case you die again, write down your coordinates. Now, if you're playing better than wolves, completely legit like me, and you type F3, you see there are no coordinates. You you don't see your height level, and you do not see your coordinates. And so that adds more challenge into the game, so... You know, you can't write down any coordinates or special places. You can't sleep in bed, so you can't set a spawn point. And you, basically, I do not know where I am in the world of Minecraft because there is no spawn point for me. There is no uh, coordinates, so I can't do that. And you can also you can also not see on what level you are in case you're mining and you want to get to the diamond level. You won't be able to find that level because you can't do it unless you're using, of course, other external mods. Which we are not going to do. I want to use thingy. Better than wolf. That's what we're using. You see this one sprouted and that silver is now gone. Silver, grey. Whatever you want to call it. If it makes you happy saying silver. If it makes you happy saying grey then you know, do it. Oh yeah. Come on boys. Keep growing. Let's do this quick, fast and easy. Shut up. Sorry. Nah, what are we going to call you? Should we call you Bernard? No. Ugh, Bernard. I've never heard such a crappy name before in my life. Sorry if your name is Bernard, but I'm just mean for a dog. I wouldn't call my dog Bernard. Mm, um, I need a door. I never realised that a door would be useful. Because I've been running for cover for the past few episodes which of course you guys won't see because uh, you know yeah I can't record it oh wait there are doors here oh my well there you go you, can have, you have a free door mate and you can have a door as well here have a door oh wrong way dang it Give me the door back. There you go. You can have a door tree. Hope you have fun with that. Oh, there's more hemp growing here. Might as well macerate the hemp whilst we wait. There's nothing else we can really do. I'm not, I don't want to go mining again. Oh, more. Just hope my hunger doesn't decrease in that time. Well, this is going to be more than 20 anyway. Oh, wrong one. And... Once this is done, we can finally stop using this hand crank and wasting all our hunger on this piece of rubbish and finally get a windmill started which will generate power for us. But we're going to need a lot more than just a windmill. We're going to need gear boxes. We're going to need uh, gear shafts, shifts, sticks, blah, blah, blah. See, you were too exhausted for manual labor. Great. That means I've got to hunt for food as well. This is time we don't have, my friend. Can I eat pumpkin? Do we have anything pumpkin-y in this game? Probably not. Right. Let's just go on a mission to find animals that are absolutely nowhere. Absolutely nowhere. I can make pumpkin pie. 
If I had wheat, of course, I don't think I can do anything with it. No, just get pumpkin seeds. Go away then. I have no use for you. Oh, there's sheep over there, which is good. This is what I need. I need these guys. Should I go over there to the single one or walk? No, nah, let's go to this one. Get these sheep. I need them. I need you guys. Don't, don't run away from me. There's no point of running. No point of crying either. Go to this last sheep. Oh! Got a false and half a heart. That would be game over for me again. Trust me, finding this place is horrible. Takes so long. Oh, he's a small sheepy. He only gave me one bit. Oh, uh, come on. I, I can't stand it. And I don't know how I could play Minecraft for like a year and a half. Or, yeah, like a year and a half without running. You know, before running, this was the speed you went at. I don't know how I could do that. <laughs> that sucks. I just can't see me playing Minecraft anymore without the running feature. Alright, quickly cook you guys up. I don't want to eat you raw. <clears throat> what? You want some too? Tough. It's mines. I can also eat the rot flesh. No, I could just suck it up and eat this. What do you think I'll actually just do? Yeah, awesome. Right, give me that. Oh, I want to see how fast it drains when you got hunger. Alright, let's do this. Or it won't drain as usual, like I said, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I think it's a bug, but the main goal is that it drains all your health. And that's why you try and make a different method of getting energy as fast as possible. Because the hand crank tires you out. There we go. So there should be only, what, four left in this thing? Three now. There's another one over there. I only need 27, so once I get this one, I'm going to stop it here. Quickly make the sail and the windmill. There we go, 27. So, I'm going to make the last three pieces. I don't know why I did two. There we go. And you put the fabric in the top, like I said before, at the bottom here. And you get a sail, and you put the four sails like this. And you shall get a windmill, finally. And let's see if I can just stick it somewhere. It's pretty big it's huge it is huge and I think you have to stick it in a gearbox I think that is the goal so probably won't be able to use it now and no I'm not gonna use it I don't wanna waste any more time guys this was the third attempt to make part three of better than walls I hope I succeeded if I didn't I will not be happy and if I did if you like the video Give it a thumbs up. And if you want to become a member of the plague, simply subscribe to my channel. We've almost reached 800 of you guys. And, oh, seriously, it tingles me. It makes me so happy. Love all of you. And I'll see you guys in Better Than The Walls Part 4. If I can ever record it. Bye-bye, guys.